Hey everybody, the Bong is here, ready to give you a brand new Let's Play. Porky Pig's Haunted Holiday for the Super Nintendo. And this is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Alright, well it's still technically the Halloween season. If you're a guy. If you're a female, chances are your Halloween season started in August. <laughs> and then you start celebrating Christmas by November 1st. Because that's how it usually goes. I always gotta have a reason to celebrate something. Oh, that might sound a little bit loud. Um, skill. Well, given that I never played this game before, forget we'll just go with normal. Let's check the controls. Okay, you can throw with Y, X with View. You can also throw with A, and then there's Jump. So I don't know what the D-pad buttons do, because <laughs> the game doesn't tell ya. Um, I guess we'll just get started. Going in there completely blind, because, you know, Halloween is about scaring people, right? As Porky Pig is looking through holiday brochures to plan his upcoming vacation, he drifts off to sleep and finds himself in a haunted, haunted holiday nightmare. Why is haunted there twice? Is this supposed to be double the haunted? Or was that an actual typo? Because if it's supposed to be double the haunted, maybe there should be a comma. I'm just saying. Oh, oh, speaking of Christmas. Okay, so why is Porky on not constantly looking at me? Oh my god. So many animation frames. Let's go to the woods. What can go wrong here? Okay, so if you hold X, you can like look right and you look left. That looks like it could hurt me, so I'm just gonna be careful. Can I jump on these enemies? Yes, I can. And the phone rings. You know what? Time out. All right, I'm back. Let's continue. It's times like these that I'm kind of glad that I do not put out, um, you know, third-party content or third-party songs for uh, ringtones. Because God knows one phone call will probably get me content ID claimed. Oh, God. What the hell? Just random boots? Ooh, cake. Don't mind if I do. Why am I taking on the Lucky Charms mascot? Well, anyway, it looks like this game's pretty easy, but I bet you it's gonna get hard later. I mean, Acclaim, Sunsoft, oh god, I didn't know that was a pit. Leprechauns just split into two. Leprechauns are actually two leprechauns put together. That is the true legend of St. Patrick's Day, apparently. There's grappling in this. They're gonna put in like a swinging mechanics like very early in this game. What's the throwing like? Why can't I throw? Pressing the Y button is not doing anything. Maybe I'm unable to throw yet. Thank God, like, grabbing this is very responsive. What was that, a checkpoint? Oh, that was just a lift. Cool, thanks. Oh, alright. Do I want to go down? Sure, I'll let me kill this guy first. Grab a fruit basket. Okay, you throw from the fruit basket. Alright. That almost reminds me of a TLC, like, them segments between Elias and Jason Jordan. Elias was trying to sing, couldn't do it because Jason Jordan kept, what, throwing vegetables at him? Granted, I'm throwing fruit, but it's almost the same thing, really. The only difference is, at least this segment follows through. There's a cauldron that just spews fire, so I have to watch out for that. I mean... Pigs definitely, uh, smell good when they're roasting. We can't have that. 
Did I just kill two enemies with like, what, one apple? I missed. Oh, apparently that's somewhere you can enter. I didn't know that. I just hit up and all of a sudden I'm here. Uh, can I get that one up? I'd like to get that one up, please. Oh, if you hold down, you can slide. Hmm. Oh, there we go. That's how I get to the lower levels. Oh, I wanted that. Thank you. <laughs> Look at the way he walks, too. Like, he's so confident. Okay, so dark parts of the cobweb you can fall through. Gotcha. Okay, for some reason I just kept lurching forward even though I stopped walking. Hmm. We. This looks like a bonus area, really. Porgy's like, fine, I'll go this way. I'll go, I'll go, I'll go this way. Kill things. Hold on, which way do I go? Am I supposed to go up here? Doesn't look like I'm able to reach that, actually. Oh, okay, I see what I gotta do. I gotta make a leap of faith. Should have been using the view option. Cause it seems like it was helping me. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to leap over here. I did it. Ho, ho, ho. I guess we're gonna be taking on evil Santa. I think. <laughs> or maybe it's Frosty that's got the problem. I mean, too many rambunctious kids just replacing the uh, carrot nose and making a carrot dong. But I got sick of it. Do some dumb hits. What are the cupcakes anyway? You just get, get an extra life for collecting a lot of them? I think that's what it is. Yeah, I think I can keep using this fruit basket until maybe I die. Oh, what is this? Something appeared. Will it still be over there if I go this way? Certainly hope so. That was dangerous. Ah, cauldrons can be killed by apples. We learn something new every day. We. Is this the chimney? I think I just went up a chimney. Oh, there seems to be no shortage of secret areas. Look how many lives I have right now. Uh, is this a Mickey Mania level or something? Like we're constantly just going around a tree? I think it's a tree. Ow. For some reason, even though I took damage, I was still able to kill that enemy. Okay, I just noticed you cannot throw while you're jumping. I think I can drop down here safely. Uh-oh. Oh, the view is not gonna work, obviously. Cool. Oh. Well, alright. So much more. Whoa. Don't fall to your death now. Maybe I just keep jumping. Yeah, that's better. Oh! I, I didn't think I could throw on a curve. Did you just notice that? That's not the way it's supposed to go. It just kept going around. 
That's some nasty curveball you got there going, Porky. I'd say all the all the main Looney Tunes characters, Porky was not exactly that memorable. Because there weren't that many, you know, like... Why did it... Why am I going... Wow. For some reason, he just kept going left. Controls are a little floaty, I'm noticing. But anyway, Porky, again, wasn't exactly my most favorite characters. Because most of the skits that I watched on TV usually had Bugs, usually had Daffy, Sylvester and his dumb kid, Tweety Bird, sometimes Foghorn Leghorn. But my favorite bits were, you know, Wily e. Coyote and Roadrunner. They were pretty much my favorite because... Wally Coyote just tries so hard, and he never gets it done. I'm pretty sure he eventually will, but it's probably just a Family Guy skit. Because I think that's what it was. I think that's the way out. Hmm. That felt like a loading screen for some reason. Oh, th this world is actually pretty long. Uh... Oh god, I was swinging the other way. What? What? I didn't grab that? What the hell? Oh, That set me back. Well, at least I didn't take a dumb hit. Okay, that was dumb. Okay, it looks like that iron ball is actually going upward, and then it goes down. Okay, I'll grab it facing the other way, that's fine. Oh, didn't see that. Didn't see that one either, but I made it. I guess you can tell what part of the branch is not going to fall, because it's usually like the light-colored branches. And if it has any snow on it, it's not going to fall. I'm just going to wait for that to go up to a safe spot. There. I claim this in the land of pig. We. Alright, so far so good. Not running into too much trouble. I'm going ham on everybody here. Oh god. Maybe not the best laid out plan to jump on top of a cauldron that's cooking. Oh. I thought I could walk past that. I mean, some of the trees you could. But that one over there you couldn't. Oh god. Okay, taking some dumb damage here. Yeah, so I can walk through it now. I think the game is trying to tell me something. I wonder where I'm supposed to go. I guess I'll just go in the opposite direction. Oh, God. So, if you get the coffee, or I assume the hot chocolate, you start floating. Luckily, you can stop yourself from uh, falling to your death by just hitting down rising to your death. Okay, so just do the same thing you've done before. Only difference is, uh-oh. No, it's, no, it's fine. I'm probably not gonna die. Maybe I should just take my sweet-ass time. Okay. Somewhere to land safely. Oh, oh god. Hey, how come I don't have my fruit basket anymore? Oops. Okay, I think I'm safe if I just stay in the corner. I kind of figured it would be the snowman. Oh, come on. I was supposed to know you would have it over there. Okay, you gotta jump on his head when his hat is off. That seems easy to remember, I guess. I think it's a good idea to just keep switching sides. 
As long as I stay in the corner, he can't hit me. And he makes a couple figure eights. And then I can jump for him then. There, if you time it right, you, you pretty much avoid damage every single time. Seems like he does that on the opposite side of where I'm too, in proportion to what I'm doing. I hit that too early. So I guess I'll just wait for one more time. His eyes just went red. I don't like that. Oh, they just go away. What am I going to do now? Oh, okay. Dry Gulch Town. Oh, that should be fun. In fact, I'm going to wait till the next episode before I do that. Goodbye, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned for the next part.